Hello and welcome to another exciting episode of Cam Tries Food. Cam Tries Food. Hello to all the new subscribers. We've almost doubled in subscribers, <laughs> unbelievably. Um, I hope you're all enjoying watching this. Um, so. This week's episode starts on a bit of a downer, unfortunately. Um, now, as part of the package sent by Katie and Fraser, they sent me some of the greatest bread that has ever existed. Uh, I first tried it uh, at the Cheesecake Factory uh, in America. It's a restaurant and they have stupidly big portions and it's incredible. But they also do unlimited free bread. And they just keep bringing it to your table when you finish it and they hot hot and it, they bring you butter and it's beautiful. And when, you ask, when you're leaving, you can ask for more bread and they bring it and it's incredible. It's the greatest thing I've ever tasted. And it was almost certainly going to get 10 out of 10. Unfortunately, it has arrived. It did go out of date on the 20th of December, but that's fine because I thought it would keep all right because it's American bread and they fling hundreds of sugar and stuff. And I thought it'd be fine. But unfortunately, I don't know if you can really see it on camera, but it is... In fact, full of mould. I don't know if you can really make it out that well. It's full of mould, and I can't express how close I am to crying. I'm very, very angry about it. <laughs> thing. I'm going to have to bleep that, sorry. I'm very upset about the whole situation. It really angered me, because uh, it's the greatest bread that's ever existed. <sighs> I guess I better do the rest of the episode. Uh, don't worry, there's a couple of exciting things coming up, uh, which I'll go through. There's three items to try this week. Three items to try. Uh, and before I go on, uh, I'm wearing the Old Bay uh, jumper again. Uh, that will be worn in every episode, I imagine. And I am actively looking for sponsorship from Old Bay, if they would like to sponsor me. Uh, you know, get, it, get this video to them, guys. <laughs> uh, I'm sure they'll love to see it. Uh, so actively looking for some sponsorship. Thanks. So what have we got this week? So this week we've got Combos Cheddar Cheese Bacon Variety. Now I think we've already tried the Buffalo Blue Cheese, might be what it's called. They got nine. So pretty excited to try these bad boys. Uh, we've also got more Old Bay uh, Seasoned Virginia Peanuts. Uh, What's the difference between Virginia Virginia peanuts and uh, normal peanuts? Uh, it's not a joke. I don't know the answer. Uh, guess they're just from Virginia. We'll see if they taste any better. Pretty excited. And last but not least, uh, the Reese's Big Cup with pretzels. Now, I didn't realise at first this was with pretzels. I thought it was with Reese's Pieces, which is something I've had before. I've never had this before, and I'm very excited because I love Reese's pe peanut butter cups. So, let us go ahead and try the first one. So I'm going to go ahead and try combos first. So we've opened it up. Hmm, they smell. They don't smell as good as other ones I've smelled. I'm not going to lie to you. But let's see. Can you hear that tune? Um. Yeah, they're nice. Um. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not blown away. They're very tasty. They're not as good as those blue cheese ones, and I could indeed demolish this whole packet. Um. But honestly, not blown away. I'm always asking to send to send me duds. This isn't a dud, but it's definitely not up there with the best of them. I mean, I do want to keep eating it repeatedly, but it it could be better. So I think it's going to score as high as other things. Um, I can't decide what I would do. Um. I think I'm going to give it a 7 out of 10. Like I said, not bad, but let's give some other things. Okay. 
That was it. It was decent. I would say they're excellent, but just compared to some other things, they're not as good. Um, should I be palate cleansing between these foods? Maybe I should be palate cleansing. Anyway, we're going to move on to the Old Bay seasoned Virginia peanuts. Now, I'm going to imagine that they probably taste similar to normal peanuts. Therefore, if they're good, I could just make them myself because I could just buy peanuts and then get Old Bay. So, let's get into these. That was an unnecessary face. Ow! Ow! What are you doing? Someone has came to visit. Hello. What's going on? Uh, so she might get in the way now. Um, okay, so I've opened them. Can confirm they smell like old bait and peanuts. Uh, no, they're not for you, Jen. Stop it. Stop it. Mmm. Oh my. Oh, they are good. Oh, man, they're good. I love peanut. And they've got the kick of old baby beside them. Hmm. Now, I don't know if it's just the peanuts. They're a little bit harder than I... Obviously, peanuts are hard, but they're a little bit harder than I was expecting. Which could ever so slightly drop them down. But, oh, they are good. Very good. What score should they get, though, Jen? She's right here. She's just at a shot, but she is in my face. Um, oh, they're very good, though. Should I mark them down, though, because they're... They've just got a little bit of bite. When you hit them, a little bit more than normal peanuts. Maybe that's the Virginianess of them. Maybe that's how they do them in old Virginia. Who knows? Uh, <laughs> okay, I think I'm ready to score them. Uh, they're very good, but they are just going to lose a point. Because they're very close to 10, but they're going to lose a point due to the, the texture slightly. So, going to go ahead. Give these. What have you done? Why can I hear my voice now? Jen, what have you done? That was rude. Go to Hood and give these. 9 out of 10! Very excellent. Very good, but they do just lose a point due to the texture, unfortunately. People are sick of hearing how good everything is, so, you know, you got got to be strict on these things. Okay, so, the last one today is the Reese's Big Cup with pretzels. So, I've not mentioned it before on the show, but Reese's are probably my favourite chocolate, the white chocolate variety especially. Um, but pretzels, I do love pretzels, so putting them inside the chocolate is could be revolutionary. Now here's the cup. It smells like Reese's. Let's get stuck in. Oh man, that's good. Um. Oh. See having that crunch in there. Oh. That is. That is something else. That's that whole thing gone. Oh, that's going to anger me that I can't just have more of that. Oh, that crunch with the chocolate. Guys, you have, you have excelled yourself with that when they're sending me that. That is unbelievable. I think you can probably guess where this is going. Um, Yeah, that's a... That's a straight up. Where am I going to put it here? 10 out of 10. <sighs> Bang on. Spot on, guys. That's beautiful. Oh. Uh, we started low. We started really low with the, the bread news. 
really, really low. We gumped up a bit with the combos. The old bay got there, and then the Reese's just took it to the top. So overall, a mixed bag this episode. But um, looking forward to he sent some duds. Uh, I'm still going to try the peanut butter jelly sandwich. That's going to be an episode coming soon. I'll just do that myself. Um, and anyone else has any snacks that they want, they, they would like to see? You know, bang some comments down there. Oh, right below the line there. Uh, don't forget that like, subscribe, uh, no down votes please. Some people have done that. That's not cool. Uh, tag Old Bay. I don't know how you tag them in YouTube. But tag them. Let them know that I want sponsored. I love their stuff. Uh, and as always, stay beautiful. This is the longest episode yet. Grace, go!